Now, if you have these kind of pulleys that have these little inserts in them, you're able to actually replace the bearings inside. I'm going to show you guys exactly how to mod these so that you can put replaceable $5 bearings into your pulleys instead of having to buy a whole new $30 pulley. So if something ever does go wrong out on the trail or while you're just cutting the grass, you can replace the bearing in 5 minutes or less with an easy job and you will not have to worry about the bearing anymore. Plus, it only costs, like I said, $5 to replace the bearing instead of having to get a whole new pulley. Alright, so let's get into this video and I'll show you guys exactly how to mod your, your pulleys on your lawnmowers. Alright, so like I was saying before, you need this style of pulley that has these little inserts in them that you're able to grind out so you can open up the two halves of the pulley to get into the bearing. So if you don't have this style, you're unfortunately not going to be able to do this or it's not going to be very easy. Anyways, let's get these into the uh, vise and get them popped open so you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. Alright, so the first thing that I did is took a self-tapper on a drill bit and drilled the top of each of these rivets. And then what I'm going to be doing is I take a step bit on my drill and I drill the top of it here. And as you guys can see, it pops off just perfectly. As soon as you get there, just like that. So I know I said grinding was the way to do it, but this is the way to do it. You can take your punch and punch them out. All right, so now with all of those drilled out, we're able to actually get this thing popped apart. So let's get this thing open and see what it looks like. All right, so all I did to actually get this popped open is took a chisel and popped the center there, and then you're left with this. All right, so two halves to a pulley with a bearing in the middle. All right. So we're left with a bearing and our two halves to our new pulley. All right, so with this system, all we're gonna be doing now is bolting these together instead of having them punched together or pressed together with those rivets. We're actually gonna be putting uh, bolts in there so that we can open this up so that you can get a new bearing in there. I'll show you guys exactly what I mean right now. All right, so now we can actually install our M5 hardware into the pulley and get it all actually finalized. Let's do it. As you guys can see, we have a brand new pulley with a brand new bearing in there, and it works great. So now when I install this back into the mower, which I already have one in the Musty, I've done this mod on the Musty, now I just carry one singular bearing instead of a whole pulley. So this is a great method of upgrading your stock pulleys, or idler pulleys, or whatever you'd like to call them, to a new um, sealed bearing pulley. So they usually come with sealed bearings, but they usually are gone by the time you get your mower because they've been on the tractor for 30 odd years. Anyways, this is such a great mod to do and so simple. It took me about half an hour in the shop and now all I need to do is buy a $5 bearing instead of a $35 pulley. So, I hope you guys like that. If you guys really like this video and other off-road mower videos, check out the channel. I got this awesome lawnmower that does some crazy things and I've shown everyone on the internet exactly how I built it on the YouTube channel. So check that out. Anyways, have a good day guys. Hope you liked it. Don't forget to do your pulley mods. Awesome. <laughs> Thank you.